Hey what's going on guys welcome to another video and in today's video I'm bringing you some web design ideas so you guys can take a little bit of inspiration to improve your websites or if you, even if you are building some websites for your clients or something you can apply these kind of uh, design ideas that I'm going to show you in here. All of them in here they are coming from this website CodePen probably you have heard about it if not don't worry, I'm going to put all the links in the description. And uh, yeah, let's start with this one in here that is really cool. It's almost like a carousel. If I press my arrows in here on my keyboard, look how it's just like changing between the different sliders. And if you press control, you can even change this like this. And the good thing, guys, about all these design ideas that I'm going to put in here is that... Uh, on CodePen, you can actually see all the code in here on the side. So basically, you can go in here and copy all the code and implement this on your website. But don't forget, of course, to um, to give credit to, to the person that uh, created this. Because it always works like this. You can even use what's in here and improve. You know, make it a little bit better, change a little bit of these things. Uh, so we got this one is really cool in here this this slider is almost like the windows um, When you press like alt tab or something like that It's really nice. So we got this one in here uh, Then we got this sign in form look at this if I press sign up in here It has some kind of animation and it moves from one. I didn't try let me just try. Ah, it doesn't happen anything in here. I'm just like trying to see. But lo look at this animation. So it's really nice the design and it has some kind of animation. Just as usual, look, you have all the code in here. HTML, CSS, JavaScript in here on the side. Okay, let's go to the next one. We got in here, this one could be for some kind of mobile application. Or, um, or even your uh, mobile website, you know, look at this This is some kind of uh, phone list We have some kind of CSS animations in here Some slide animations really cool This is the same I'm going in here. There is nothing activity and in here you got like the bio of the website and stuff Oh, this is the same guy, I, Sami, okay? This is the same guy. I didn't even realize from this one in here, Sami. Okay, let's go to this next one. This one is really cool. It's almost like a gallery that you can click, has a spinner, and then shows up all the content. Really cool. So this is something that you could implement if you have some kind of gallery that you want to show some information. Okay, let's go to the next one in here. Uh, this one is just like for some kind of mobile application. You can click and it has show up. It's hiding and fading in, fading out. We got uh, this one I really, really like. Look at this in here. This kind of carousel. Really cool. So you can put this, for example, on your home page as a header, or you could put in some kind of product page and with some stuff in here. Look at this. Let's go to the next one. Uh, this is another carousel that when you hover, look, it's just like moving around with your mouse as well. Really nice. I don't know why we have a lot of bread in here. <laughs> Maybe this is like for some kind of bakery, but you could put any images that you would like in here. In here we just have some kind of gallery. You click, you have a drop down and then some content in here and then you can close it. Some really nice and simple design. Imagine you could use for example this for your portfolio website if you if you are a web developer and you are trying to put some kind of your projects you could put in here all your projects and then when you click you have some image about your your uh, project and then some kind of description about it so this is another cool 
design in here. Ah, this one in here would be some kind of uh, look at this animation for a navigation bar. You know, oops, something. Look at this. Really nice. All the code in here on the side, just as usual. Don't forget about this. And of course, look, the links are in here at the top as well. I'm gonna try to put them on the description. In here we have some, uh, look at this, some burger menu animations. Another one in here. This is really cool in here. Okay. Oh, this, this is really cool as well, look. You got some kind of text and when you hover, this kind of bold is gonna show a little bit more information about it. This would be good like for some kind of blogs or something like that. Or if you have a, a website full of content. Right, now we have some kind of animations in here. Ah, uh, this, this is really cool, for example, if your website is loading and you don't want, for example, people to be waiting, like they don't see anything on the page, you could actually build these kind of loaders. And if you don't exactly know how to implement this, I have um, I have a tutorial on my website, in, on my website, on, on my channel in here, how to implement this. So in here you have all the code to how does it look like. But if you want to implement this on when the page is just like loading, I have a tutorial on, on the channel in here for it. In here there is a couple of different uh, loaders as well. And we got another one in here. And finally we got this one in here. This is really cool as well. Alright guys, I think that's it for this video. I showed you a lot of different things that you can implement on your website. You got all the code, all the source in here. And it's always good to go and check other, other people um, work, you know, to get some kind of inspiration. And uh, yeah, you can even use what they have in here, like I said, and just like improve on what they did. For example, imagine this guy in here has this kind of person in here. Um, just going, you could change the colors or you could put, for example, stars. You could put this, for example, in the space, <laughs> change the background or anything. But yeah, guys, I think that's it for this video. I hope you like it. And like I said, I'm going to put the links in the description. If you like this video, make sure to leave me a thumbs up. Subscribe to the channel if this is your first video and I'll see you in the next one.